what's up youtube welcome back to my channel and today's video we're gonna be looking at wild card it's actually been two years since i actually did a review on this skin so here we go wild card here's a legendary outfit he is part of the getaway gang set he does come in four selectable styles which basically the face mask does change he does come with the backlink cuff case so without further ado guys let's get this review started so wild card Released September 28th of 2018, he's a John Wick clone. He was the first John Wick clone, but that's not a bad thing. The Reaper, or John Wick like everybody else called him during Season 3, was an all slick, thin male design that we hadn't seen it prior to him, and the wall card was second to do that. The wall card does have a suit similar to the Reaper skin, and it fits. It looks very clean, especially with an all white instead of black color scheme. And then he did have that match, but it, does he match the rarity? I'm gonna say he does. Even though he's a very simple skin, it's still an iconic skin. It does have four selectable styles. Even though the styles are primarily only your opponents could see, they're still pretty cool. I do like it because you mix and match depending on what color you do use. So what's my final rating for the wild card? I'm gonna have to give the wild card a 10 out of 10. I mean, it goes against everything I normally say about the skin being too simple or not having enough of something, but in this case, it actually works. The backlink itself is very universal as well, since it's just a briefcase on your back, and then the color scheme of all white with black actually matches really well. So, without further ado, guys, let's get this combo started. For the first combination, I am pairing up the wild card with the heart style, and I'm pairing it up with the arc wings. I would normally use the Love Wings with this design, but the Arc Wings after their release is just a better take on the skin. The wings themselves are completely white, which really complements the white suit he does have, and overall, looks nice. For the Harving Tool, we're going with the Tadax. The main reason why I'm going with the Tadax is because it does have wings that complement the wings on the skin, and then it does have a heart, as you can tell, it does complement the face heart he does have. And for the Glider, I'm going with the Metal Rider. The main reason why I'm using the Metal Rider is for the all white slick design. It does have the Marshmallow logo in the dead center of it, but it doesn't really destruct the combination. It is all black, so it really complements it as well. For the Contra, I'm going with the Hearts. The Hearts Contra fits perfectly with this combination, especially because it does have a heart on his face, and then the Harvin tool does have a heart, so it just complements everything very nice. And for the wrap, I'm going with the Red Line. The Red Line wrap is an animated wrap. It's basically what the name refers to. It's just a red line going across each weapon or vehicle, as you're holding it it looks very cool the curve combination matches perfectly and overall looks really well so enjoy the combo For the next combination, I'm pairing up the wild card with the Spades Edit out, and I'm pairing it up with the Deadpool's Katanas. The main reason why I'm using the Deadpool Katanas, not for the fact that everybody should have this backlink this, since it is free during this season, but because it's all black and it matches really well with the black design he does have on his face and feet. And overall, it contracts the white very nicely. For the Harvin tool, we're going with the Thorn with the black edit out. The Thorn itself looks like a Green Reaper Harvin tool. It looks amazing with him, especially with the all black and slick design of it. It just matches really well. And for the glider, we're going with the one shot. We are using an all black aesthetic combo here, so the one shot fits that criteria. A very slim but yet amazing glider. It is all black and overall fits this whole thing. And for the contra, I'm going with the bats. The main reason why I'm going with the bats control is for the dark aura it does leave on your hands and feet. It looks really cool and then the bats is just an added taste to it. And for the wrap, I'm going with the A ball. The A ball is a black and white wrap. It looks amazing especially because those are the main color schemes I am using with this combination. So enjoy the combo.
For the last combination, I'm going with the Wild Heart with the Clover Edit Stout and I'm going to be pairing it up with the Lane Splitter. In my opinion, the Lane Splitter looks a lot better than the Ignition Backlink just because it does have that black with white color scheme that really complements the black and white this skin does have. I really do like how it sits on the back and then the Katana is an added flavor to it. For the Harvey to work on the Bang Shot with the Scratch Edit Stout. The main reason why I'm using the Scratch Edit Stout, it makes the dual wheeling Harvey tools into an all white Harvey tool. It does have little hinges of black, but as you can tell with the skin, the skin is primarily all white, so it fits. For the glider, I'm going with the big haul with the Edestyle Ghost. The main reason why I'm going with the Edestyle Ghost is because it does make the glider all white. It looks very clean, it matches perfectly with the theme of the skin, and overall it just fits the whole concept. For the Contra, I'm going with the Cash Flow. The Cash Flow is basically what the name implies, it's just cash falling from your body. It is very simple but yet effective especially with the big hog glider. And wrapping it all together I'm going with the shadow angular shift. The shadow angular shift is a black and white wrap. It is animated, it looks very cool especially when you're in the heat of battle. So enjoy the combo. Those are the three combinations I've found so far for wildcard. Let me know in the comments below which one's your favorite. And if you're new to my channel, subscribe. I post videos of your favorite cosmetic skins every single day. And if you want to support the channel, my code is ENIGMAKID, all caps, two Ds, all together. Each time you guys use my code in either the Iron Shop or the Epic Game Store, I do get a small percentage of it and really help the channel grow. And with that being said, guys, I'll catch you guys in the next video. See ya.